So the Northeast is digging out once again today. And at this point, we almost sound like a broken record telling you about the snow. We've seen the video of the snowstorm after snowstorm up there. But what about here? When do we get the snow? You're asking, and Two Wants to Know is answering. According to our average breakdown of snowfall, 48% of snow in the triad falls right now after February the 1st. So where is the snow? You know where it is? It's in the Two Wants to Know weather lab. Chief Meteorologist Grant Gilmore, he's making the snow. Yeah, you know, since we really haven't seen any real snow, we're going to bring you into the WFMI News 2 weather lab and talk about how snow forms because you really do need a specific criteria, requirements to get some snow forming. So yeah, this is our WFMI News 2 weather lab and we're talking about how snowflakes are formed. So we've already got our snow trees in the background with some snow. The first thing that you need way up in the atmosphere in the clouds is you need temperatures to be below freezing. So we've got the mercury below freezing. It's chilly here in the weather garden, isn't it? Right? The next thing that you absolutely need is what we call this is a fancy term for it, but it's called a condensation nuclei. It's that point to where the water vapor in the atmosphere can condense onto this. Now, this is something like sand, dust, soil, or something really small. It has to be about a tenth of a micrometer, very, very small. So let's shrink that thing into the atmosphere there. Then what you need is water vapor. You need a lot of that water vapor molecules in the atmosphere. So there's our condensation nuclei right there. You have our water vapor all around it. Temperatures below freezing and tiny little ice crystals will begin to form on that condensation nuclei. It keeps on absorbing more and more of that water vapor and more and more of those ice crystals form from that condensation nuclei and you have one single snowflake. From there, that happens billions upon billions of times. It becomes heavy, it begins to fall, and then you have snow right here in the WFMI News 2 Weather Lab. If you have a weather question, you can always find us on Twitter and Facebook or send me an email in the Weather Lab at GGilmore at WFMY.com. What do you think, Tanya? Pretty I cool, love huh? it. It's snow magic it's and snow tastic. Yes. It is all of those and more. <laughs> Thanks so much, Grant.